All right, so we're on to example two, and this one is about daylight savings time. And daylight savings time is the practice of putting clocks an hour forward. Countries usually use daylight savings time so that people get an extra hour of sunlight after work. And it means that dads can, and mums of course, can go home and have some time to play with the kids. Uh, it's usually only implemented um, during half the year, which is sort of during your warmer summer months. And you'll also notice that countries in the tropics don't usually use daylight savings time. And the reason being that is that they get plenty of sun during the day anyway, so they don't really need it. Remembering that countries in the tropics are the ones that are close to the equator. Now, if we look at example two, Sydney, Australia, which we mentioned earlier, is on Eastern Standard Time, which is 10 hours um, after, 10 hours ahead of UTC. Sydney observes daylight savings time. And during daylight savings, Sydney has basically renames their time zone. And rather than calling it Eastern Standard Time, they call it Eastern Daylight Time, or EDT. And this time it's a plus 11. Notice that the time zone has added one hour because during daylight savings time you add an hour onto your time. Now Perth in Australia does not observe daylight savings time. Perth runs on Western Standard Time, which is WST plus eight. They're eight hours ahead of UTC. All right, now let's get into the question. Jim wants to call his friend in Perth at 5 p.m. Western Standard Time. All right, now Jim lives in Sydney, which is currently running on daylight savings time, so they're on plus 11, 11 hours after UTC. What time should Jim call his friend? Okay, so once again, it's usually useful to draw some type of a number line to help you work these things out. All right, now, we're going to put the 5 p.m. here. It says that Jim wants to call his friend in Perth at 5 p.m. Uh, Western Standard Time. So he wants to call his friend so that when his friend picks up the phone, it's 5 o'clock in Perth. So 5 p.m. and let's write Perth. Okay. Now, Jim lives in Sydney. Now, Sydney is ahead of Perth in time. And Sydney is running on daylight savings time. Right, so Jim wants to call at a particular time in Sydney so that when it when um he calls his friend, his friend picks up the phone at five o'clock. Okay, now um, notice that Sydney is on plus eleven and Perth is on plus eight. So we just go eleven minus eight, which is three or three hours, which means three hours ahead of five o'clock, so 8 p.m. All right, so if I, if, if Jim picks up the phone at eight o'clock in Sydney and calls his friend in Perth, his friend is going to pick up the phone at five o'clock. So our answer is eight o'clock p.m.